There's like a whole party downstairs going on. I love that there is a disco house. Yeah, <laughs> with lots of branded purple things. Yes. Yeah. I am Amy Patton. I run a company called One Riot. We have a publishing company and a record label. My name is uh, Daniel Higby. I work at Dual Tone Music Group, um, a record label out here in Nashville. Also do publishing. Part of a larger group called Monarch, MNRK. I mean, I've always loved like soundtracks to film. And I would, at the end of the movie, see the credits and see what songs were in there. Super influenced by like Quentin Tarantino movies, Wes Anderson, and the music like being a big part of that story. And I'm like, I want to be a part of that world. He's, he's a legend and sing. <laughs> well, good. Yeah, yeah he's good at it. <laughs> I like remember for me watching the OC mm. and Alex Pizzavas like became like a hero to me. Like the music is just as much of a star as the show. Right, is. right. The music could elevate the scene. The scene elevates the music, and it kind of lasts like a lasting like imprint of that. I do think that like the legacy of Chop Shop is still mm, right, right. so big because of like Grays and all the shows. All the Shonda Rhimes shows. All the Shonda Rhimes shows, but e even like Twilight and stuff like that. No, it you know? changed things. Yeah, it totally changed things. Carl is, he's a legend, okay? He's got a legendary beard. I met him through a client who Carl would give her one big sink a year, like a six figure sink and it would just like pay for everything. So I was like, who's this Carl guy? He's like, right. he's very mysterious to me. I That's need to nice. meet him. And when he came over, he told me about disco and he was like, do you know any music supervisors? And I was like, the, the main one is Chop Shop. You should meet the people at Chop Shop. Mm. And he was like, I'd love to meet him. So I introduced him to Casey Truman and then Chop Shop said, if you want to pitch to us, you got to use disco. And then, yeah, that's there you go. You guys started yeah. using disco. It made sense yeah. for, you know, us at Secret Road and then at Dual Tone, I kind of, I helped bring in disco as well. Mm -hmm. And beyond me, I, I use it for a pitching tool with Sync, mm -hmm. which is great. But then across the board for all our like, catalog management. Yeah, catalog management or radio team. Totally. As well. And being able to, you know, have all your, your contacts. All Just sign things. a contact. Right. Yeah. With to URL, so if you're like, I want to see if this person opened right. this email. Right, and I'm still like figuring out more. Oh, I use that out yeah. of the time. No, it's great. It's been. We're real you know, disco. We are. Here. I mean, it's <laughs> true. <laughs> We're not getting paid to say this. It's, it's <laughs> yeah, <laughs> true. Here we go. All right. Hey, this was lovely. That was, that was lovely. This was lovely. We should do it again. Yeah, sometime. we should do it again sometime. <laughs>